And it's Kim Kreitzer for CBSI Services Talking Business. We're at the CardCon Conference in Washington, D.C. Have a chance to talk with a gentleman who put this all together, and that is Jason Steele. Jason, good to see you. This was a tremendous success. What were the highlights for you? Thanks, Ken. We uh, had a, a great time here over the last day and a half, or two days, really. We, we started with a visit to Nationals Park, sponsored by PenFed. Uh, we got to do some batting practice there. Uh, they're a sponsor of the Nationals. It was great that we were able to uh, visit a major league park and hang out in the dugout. It was, it was so cool. And then on Monday morning, we um, heard from Adam Levin, who was a former, uh, who was the founder of Credit.com and now is the chairman of Cyber Scout, which uh, helps individuals and organizations with cybersecurity, which is just a, a, a top of mind issue in the credit and credit card industries. And of course, for our readers, we had seven great. Uh, panel discussions about credit, credit cards, affiliate marketing. Uh, we had a really nice chat with Winnie's son, with me and Winnie on here on stage. Winnie is a superstar in financial planning and social media stardom, uh, also a credit card enthusiast like myself, uh, and it's always great to talk to her. We had an amazing event called Ignite last night where we gave five minute TED Talks, so to say, about fun and interesting, inspiring, informing topics. Uh, and we even had um, uh, an analyst from the CFPB, Consumer Financial Protection Bureau, speaking this morning about trends in the credit card industry. So hearing it right from the source here in Washington, D.C., and now we're wrapping up with networking, which for many people is the real value add to this conference. When they can make that connection, uh, it helps them and their business uh, throughout the rest of the year. So really excited to wrap up the third annual card con to go home and see my family having been here all week from FinCon uh, and really looking forward to uh, card con next year which will likely be in Denver we'll be announcing it soon uh, the place and the dates uh, but we're building momentum and this is the conference for the credit and credit card industries well you certainly have put together a great gathering of, of writers and uh, online uh, uh, providers within the business uh, and, and also brands uh, uh, coming together. What was your inspiration for putting this together a few years ago? Well, I've been involved in FinCon, which is a personal finance bloggers convention. I've been involved in that almost since the inception. Uh, and I've worked with uh, Philip Taylor uh, to produce content and events throughout FinCon. But eventually I realized that, uh, you know, we were getting together for a dinner uh, or, or one panel discussion and yet us as an industry was broader than that or, or deeper than that and and we needed our own event so the last three years we've partnered with FinCon to have CardCon just before or after FinCon at the same hotel uh, but next year we're um, we're splitting off and going independent we've, we're, we're growing up and moving out of dad's basement uh, so to say uh, and so that gives us the ability to hold the conference uh, at a time that doesn't conflict with any other credit card industry events uh, in a place that's best suited for the needs of a conference of say three to four hundred people rather than uh, three thousand people um, and it just gives us a lot uh, more potential to to grow in different ways so I'll always be a big fan of FinCon I'll always be there uh, but I know that um, CardCon is going to flourish uh, in its own venue and its own time and place. Well. Well, uh, uh, you put together a lot of great topics today. Uh, uh, a little bit of concern by some of the speakers about the economy and how, how banks and online issuers should handle that. Uh, by, and then the thought was to really maintain the quality of services that you provide, benefits uh, across the board. Um, that was a, a key topic. And, and we learned a little bit about uh, all the online uh, uh, credit card comparison websites. You had a good group, and uh, we heard some good sessions. Yeah, it's a great group of people. I mean, I think the majority of content written about credit cards were written by people who attended this conference. Uh, and that's saying something. I mean, we are the people who teach America how to use their credit and credit cards. You know, another real highlight um, is uh, Jack Honar from CBSI. Honestly, many people came up to me uh, after, after he spoke at his roundtable discussion about credit card benefits saying that was an amazing topic, that everyone knows about the basic terms and conditions of the cards, but we have relatively little insider industry information about how, how cardholder benefits work. And we're living in a time of unprecedented um, flux in that industry where 
where credit card issuers are, are alternatively adding or removing benefits. And we as writers and journalists are really curious to know what's driving this and how this is going. And I know that Jack was able to shed a lot of light on this issue that's, that's really affected consumers a lot in the last year, more so than in previous years. Well, Jason, you've done a terrific job. We're so glad at CBSI to be able to participate. And I know Jack enjoyed doing uh, the roundtable sessions yesterday. And uh, so I really just want to say thank you and congratulations on a great job. And we're going to look forward to keeping in touch. Just final thought, what are you, any uh, key topics you're going to be writing about this fall? Well, you know, everyone's been writing about the Apple card, but I happen to know in the next couple of weeks a, another major retail branded card will be released. That's all I can say at this moment. But when it happens, you'll be like, oh, yeah, that's what Jason was talking about. So look for a big announcement later this month from a major card issuer regarding a major retailer. Uh, I hope I haven't already said too much. <laughs> okay, we'll look forward. We'll follow your writings. And uh, and uh, so glad to be able to be a part of your conference. Jason Seal, thank you from all of us. Thank you. And congratulations. And we'll look forward to uh, work with you going, going down the line. Thank hey, you. You're welcome. This is Ken Kratzer at CardCon in Washington, D.C. for CBSI Services Talking Business.